Hey, what's up? It's your girl, Neek, and you're tuned in to Neek at Night. Okay, so I've been busy all over BET Weekend, and I have not been able to keep up with the celebrity news and gossip by reporting to you guys what has been going on. Your girl has been out here grinding. Anyways, it looks like Offset and Cardi B secretly got married. Since I've been away from you guys, I'm going to go ahead and go live and report the news to you guys live. <laughs> Alright. Hey, what's up, you guys? So, your girl been moving and shaking in these Hollywood streets. But, um, I was like, you know what? Let me report a news story live since I kind of been, um, slacking. So, it looks like Cardi B and Offset have officially tied the knot. But, they did it all the way back in September. Um, Cardi B seems to be a little bit upset that the news broke that her and Offset tied the knot. Um, yesterday was the BET Awards, and at the awards, Offset thanked his wife. So it got people wondering, like, if they had actually gotten married. I'm going to play the little snippet of Offset thanking his wife, which is Cardi B, and then I'm going to read you guys the news report, and then I'm going to um, read you guys Cardi B being upset. But while I do all of that, make sure to hit that like button right now. Um, that helps me out. So do you do that right now for me? <laughs> Anyways, okay. So this is Offset thanking his wife. Thank God, I thank my wife. You should thank yours. Thank God, I thank my wife. You should thank yours. Okay, so that was him accepting his award and thanking his wife. Um, so y'all know TMZ was definitely going to start doing some digging and you know, they got the scoop. They pulled up an official marriage license certificate that showed that, um, they were married in the state of Georgia and his government name is Kiari and hers is of course Belkalese. So they, um, pulled up the whole marriage license anyway. So according to TMZ, it says Cardi B and Offset are already married. And documents show they actually tied the knot months ago, which explain why he's now calling her his wife in public. We did some digging and found out they got a marriage certificate in Fulton County, Georgia on September 20th, 2017. For you single folks, the marriage certificate is filed with the court after a couple does the deed as proof the marriage really happened. So they really got married. Um, Cardi B then took to social media to kind of rant because I guess she, this is something that she wanted to keep private. Um, I don't know why, like they're about to have a baby together. So I don't know why this is something that she definitely wanted to keep private until she was ready to announce it. Maybe she wanted to announce it once she had her baby. I'm not sure. But, um, she took to, uh, Instagram to pretty much uh, express how, you know, she was upset that the news leaked. Anyways, so in the post, she said, this is why I named my album Invasion of Privacy, because people will do the most to be nosy about your life. Well, fuck it. So um, she put, there are so many moments that I share with the world, and then there are moments that I want to keep for myself. Getting married was one of those moments. Our relationship was so new, breaking up and making up. We had a lot of growing up to do, but we were so in love. We didn't want to lose each other. Was, was one morning in September, we woke up and decided to get married. We found someone to marry us and she did. Just the two of us and my cousin. I said I do with no dress, no makeup, and no ring. I appreciate and love my husband so much for still wanting for me to have that special moment that every girl dreams of when he got down on his knee and put a ring on my finger. And he did that for me. Well, now, since you little nosy fucks know, at least y'all can stop saying I had a baby out of wedlock. So she wanted y'all to know that, you know, this wasn't no pregnancy out of wedlock, that her and Offset are married. And I guess in that rant, it's to me, I guess it's saying that they were married before he engaged. And the only reason he engaged was for her to have her special moment. That's kind of what I gather from what she said. I could be wrong, but she said that they got married in September. And then, you know, him putting on the show for the engagement was 
for her to have that special moment that every girl dreams of. I covered this. I'm not sure. I think it was in November that he engaged to her. Hold up. When did he engage? Oh, it was October. Okay. So, yeah. So, they got married after. I mean, they got married before the engagement, which, I mean, hey, I nothing really comes as a surprise with these celebrities. So, yeah, they got engaged in October, but, um, you know, they were married in September. So, yeah. So, like, I, I guess I was reading it right. Um, since it was just the two of them, I mean, I guess they can still, like, do like a vow ceremony for like the rest of the world. And I'm sure that's probably what they, what they will do. You know, these people capitalize off of every moment that they can. And I'm sure that's them that people will still tune into. But, um, what do you guys think about Cardi B and Offset getting married? And they got married before we even knew that they were even engaged. So what do you guys think about that? I'm going to look right now at the comments and see what you guys are talking about. Um, let's see. Uh, shout out to Julian Alfred. He says, hey, what's up, LaShondra Taylor? She says, hey, um, Shy Town Shasha. I know she's happy. She's crazy about him. Um, Bella Bella, because she don't want extra drama. Damn me says she needs to get over privacy. Those days are over unless she changes her team. Um, Adira Yasharahal, I don't even want to butcher your name. I'm so sorry. Um, she said she probably didn't want anyone to find out because she wanted a wedding special. Yes, I'm sure. And I'm sure even though the news is out, um, being that she's making sure that people know that she got married and she didn't have makeup on and she, it was just her and him. I'm sure they're still going to have a wedding special because they want to capitalize on every dollar and people will still tune in. Like they're still going to tune in with, even though we know that they're already married, people are still going to tune in. Um, Dark Shadow says, I think it's an omen to get married. I'm afraid it is, wait, wait. I'm afraid it is to their detriment, but I pray I'm wrong and they enjoy a long, happy marriage. Um, and then Adira was correcting me saying it was in October. Um, super new says, Oh my God. Hey, you are so beautiful, sis. I recently found your page. You're so articulated and your stories are so interesting. Love unique. Thank you. Super new. Thank you for um, finding my channel. I really appreciate the people that rock with me. Um, I'm very close to 50 K subscribers. And once I reach 50 K subscribers, um, I was thinking about doing a giveaway, but it'd be a lot of drama around these giveaways. So <laughs> I'm like, man, I don't, I don't need none of the extras, you know, like I, I just want to have like a genuine giveaway or something, step, something like special to my subscribers, but we'll see what happens. But I want to do that when I reach 50 K and I'm kind of close. Like, I feel like by July, I should be like, probably like by the mid July. I should be at 50K, hopefully before that, you know, but you know, um, let's see, uh, Shy town Shasha says, hopefully he doesn't keep cheating. Roof Daily says, I wish them the best. Super new. Keep it up. You are star sis. Thank you. Um, Kimmy Ann, love your positive energy. Thank you, Kimmy. Thanks for tuning in. Um, yes, you're very articulate and beautiful queen. Thank you, Adira. I, I hopefully I'm saying it right. Um, Shy Town says maybe a t-shirt or a hat. Um, let's see. Uh, Maddie said, "Hey, Nick, I'm glad they are married. I just wanted them to have a public wedding." And he said, "Thank he he said thanked his wife at the BT Awards." Yeah, Maddie, that's what I said at the beginning of this live. You probably just tuned in, but yeah, this all came from him thanking his wife at the BT Awards, and you know. TMZ and people started to, you know, do some digging to find out if they were married and they confirmed that they were by a marriage certificate. Um, let's see. Uh, I think he will continue to cheat. They just started a family. So I wish them the best. I want them to be happy. Um, I'm your complexion. So I want to buy me a hat. Um, I don't even think I want to sell them. I think I just want to give them away to you guys, honestly. Um, but you know, we'll see what happens. Uh, Ruth Daly says, continue to do well. All right. So that's all for the whole Cardi B and Offset being married. I'm going to end this live and then, um, I'll either come back live talking about another topic, but I kind of want them to be like, um, not 
you know, like gone into other things. So um, I'm going to end this live and I missed y'all, you know, like I really did miss y'all. So um, yeah, so I'm going to end this live and then I might be back. I'm going to look and see what other stories there is right quick that I could report live. And then I'm going to report some YouTube drama to you guys. I haven't done like a YouTube drama video in a while. So I'm going to do that. I'm not going to do that live because I got to put all the pieces together and, you know, all of that. So I can't do that live. But um, yeah, I'm going I'm to be back live after I see which story um, I can report to you guys real quick. So that's all for, um, you know, this story <laughs> make sure to hit that subscribe button if y'all not subscribed and hit that like button right now all right guys peace